Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Chicken Dragon Play Stellaris. Um, I want to warn you of a couple of things. Um, first off, is the fact that this may be a very short streaming session slash video. Um, I'm trying to figure out what is wrong with Solaris, and I don't want you guys to lose any gameplay. And seeing as it's only happening on this stage, I'm trying to see what it is that's not working. Um, because whatever it is, is really frustrating me. And I don't want you guys to lose out on that. So, I am going to be... Um, I'm sorry if that gets in your way um, and frustrates you guys, but I've got to try and figure out what this is going on. And seeing as this is the only save that is being affected at the moment, um, I'm betting it's probably has something to do with the size that we're playing on and how big we are, but I'm not sure. Um, so we'll just see um, how it goes. So. Pause. We're playing on normal speed. that's causing the problem because my CPU is very very powerful my CPU well extends past what um, goes well past what the recommended is so if I suddenly cut out Situation. during the stream I apologize um, it's not that I'm wanting to. We're going to start out slow, and it will probably just complete. keep it slow. See if it crashes on slow. Construction um, complete. Just trying to see what's going on, and I don't want you guys to miss out on gameplay. As I've said. Let's check our CPU. As we go through, we'll see what's causing Stellaris to crash, if anything is causing Stellaris to crash. Maybe it's just a bug that they haven't gotten around to fixing. We don't know. Hello, boys. Situation log updated. Situation log updated. Go ahead and survey that system after you're done with that. Have a couple of ones that have dropped back within our borders. Nice. A couple of them that are just barely on the borders. We'll go ahead and send guys here to see what we can do to sort of build out a little bit um build a re 
research station. Little mining stations. Construction complete. Anomaly found. Go ahead and research the anomaly. Looking good there. Hopefully, Stellaris doesn't continue crashing. Um, I don't know what it was. We're starting out on slow speed. On normal speed, I mean. Um, if you have any ideas why it might be crashing, please feel free to put it in chat. Because I am curious. Um, I am going to bump us up to fast speed gone about five minutes without crashing we've been playing most of the game on fast speed swirling shadows okay construction complete like I said this doesn't seem like a CPU problem to me because if it were a CPU problem, it would probably be more than just, um, probably be a lot more than just one, uh, game cutting off. I'm betting it would probably be any active services I have, but up until we get it figured Research out, complete. I'm not going to rule anything out. We got Marauder Missiles! Wonderful. Um, I apologize if my commentary is going to be less than it normally is, but... Um, I am still trying to figure this stuff out. Research complete. Let's go ahead and grab some more battleships. Cruisers. Corvettes. Um, could go for even more propaganda transmissions, um, but I don't think we're going to do that. Let's go with Gene Banks. Defensive Pacts. Okay. What are the Rixie doing? On aggression pact System and the rivals with the Oki. It's fine. Not exactly unexpected. So you guys get in orbit there. We are quite sovereignty of Bevere, which is to. Okay, then go to war with them. Don't bother me with it. I'm not looking to go to war with them. I don't care. Don't bring me in on your wars when you're literally on the other side of the galaxy. Let's see, how long before we can go to war? Can't declare war until 2386. It may have been simple overheating. Uh, that may have been why it is. But until I know why Solaris was going offline. Unfortunately, my computer is in the hottest room of the house. And, uh... So that can be a problem. And given that we haven't crashed for a while, I would say that's the most likely problem. Our engineering research is so overwhelming compared to our other research at the moment. It's really kind of scary. Let's go ahead and have Candrius Prime go ahead and just build us another couple of construction ships. Let's 
go ahead and upgrade these to the new Marauder missiles. Oh yeah. Go ahead and save that design. Um, oh, I forgot. We also have hyper shields. Yeah. System um, something tells me we are going to be obliterating in our next war with most people. Maybe not everybody will be just, oh no, the world is ending! But a lot of people will be significantly um, significantly depressed when they see just how um, just how overpowering our force will be. Zero point reactor go there. Yeah, that works better. Okay. Let's put maybe the cruiser. Let's go here. Grade two Marauder missiles. Oh, and I forgot we have the uh, we have the next level of barrier point defense. So we need to go ahead and put those in. And it's perfect there, but I forgot we need to add shields. Ah, we probably don't need to. We haven't been losing that many cruisers. So maybe we don't need to worry about that. But just leave it at that. Sounds good to me. Um, let's see. Marauder missiles where we need them. There, 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 and there. Do we have anything better at the laser? Tachyon Lance. What do we have there? 232 damage. Let's compare that to the um, Devastator torpedoes that we have on at the moment. Replacing. Tachyon Lance goes there. Um, we're not going to put it in every position, every large position, but I want at least one on there. 75% armor penetration, why not? Um, let's go ahead and upgrade our point defense. And let's see what we can do about this little problem. Um, hmm. Maybe put hyper shields. Let's replace hyper shields there. Okay. That's what we have at the moment. What if instead of that, we put that and that? Still not enough. Okay. Um, gonna bump that. We put hyper shields there and there. Now, put zero point reactor there. Zero point reactor there. Hyper shields there and there. That works. That works out. We'll use that. It's not perfect, but hey, we'll take it. Um, okay. System survey complete. Let's go ahead and send in our first abyssal flotilla. Construction complete. Let's go to the wet fleet system and fleet. deal with the ancient mining drones there. That would appear to be plaguing the system. We voted no. Leave us alone. We're losing energy credits, but we have so many that losing energy credits is no big deal. 
Let's go ahead and have our construction ships begin working on some more mining stations up here. Um, getting some of these opportunities up. How are we doing research wise? Um, we have five months remaining on heat recyclers. 25 months remaining on clone commandos. 21 months remaining on focused arc emitters. Mm -hmm. So this construction ship. Build mining stations there. Fleet engaged. Mining stations there. Um, let's see. We've done a whole lot of research, so hopefully, uh, before too long, we'll start to see it evening out a little bit more and see some of the more interesting things to research. Let him go and research that. Research. And their equivalent, but their technology level is um, their technology level is superior to us. But that's getting scarily close to where you want to be. Let's go ahead and grab hull integrity for more ship points, ship hull points. That sort of stuff you just can't go wrong with. Let's have our science ships move out and explore some of this Rixie area if we can. Doesn't hurt to know your enemy. These guys will very soon be our enemies. Let's go ahead and have this science ship survey these boys. These nice boys here. It's about time for war. We have about three years left. We will be dealing with the Boki, and hopefully that whole sector of guys. Situation. The Tyrone, yeah. Mosquita, and Dontar. All in one go at that point. Um, let's have... sector is looking good. Have you go there, build research stations and mining stations. Got an ancient life pod. Okay. Starting to stutter a little bit. Our frame rate's dropping a little bit, but not much. Not too bad. Um... have you go up here and begin working on those mining stations. We have a lot of ships done. Um, our fleet power is significant. And we just crashed. Oh, did we crash?